Hello everyone, choosing the right note-taking app can be a game changer for students, professionals, or even going paperless. Today, we're diving into Notability and GoodNote 6 to see what they offer and which one suits your needs best. Let's keep it quick and get started. First up, we have Notability created by Ginger Labs in 2010. It's loved for its clean, minimalist interface and robust audio recording that syncs with your notes in real time. It's perfect for lectures or meetings. It offers a variety of pen tools, shape detection, and a gallery of free templates. The free version is solid, but premium features like handwriting to text and extra templates require $14.99 yearly subscriptions. It's iOS only with a focus on simplicity and privacy features like password protected notes. Now, GoodNote 6. Developed by time-based technology since 2011, it's a favorite for its realistic handwriting feel and advanced customization. You get AI-powered handwriting recognition, spell check, and study sets for flashcards. It supports cross-platform use on iOS, Mac, Windows, and Android. The free version is limited, but you can opt for a $9.99 yearly subscription or a one-time $29.99 purchase for Apple devices. It's great for organizing large note libraries and collaborative work. So how do they stack up? Let's break it down. Notability shines for quick note-taking and audio syncing, ideal for students in lecture-heavy courses or professionals needing fast capture. GoodNote 6 wins for customization, cross-platform support, and advanced features like AI collaboration. It's perfect for STEM students or creative note-takers managing complex projects. The verdict? Choose Notability for simplicity and audio-driven workflows, and go with GoodNote 6 for flexibility, AI tools, and multi-device use. Try their free versions to see what fits your style, and let us know which ones you're picking in the comments. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech tips like this one, and I'll see you in the next video.